you know that there are certain movies you'll never be allowed to see because China forbids it? It's true. And the movies you do see have been altered to win approval from the Chinese Communist Party. It's reported that the version of Tom Cruise's flight jacket in the new Top Gun will be missing a patch from Japan or Taiwan. We all know that China censors what they allow their people to see. Believe it or not, Winnie the Pooh is forbidden there because some people think their communist leader Xi Jinping looks like Pooh Bear. So he had the character banned. But why would the Chinese Communist Party be so concerned about what you watch? The answer is that this is part of their unrestricted warfare plan to subjugate America over time. Unrestricted warfare is a military doctrine designed to use non-military means to defeat an adversary. The doctrine was published in a book 20 years ago and the Chinese Communist Party has followed it carefully to defeat America while we barely noticed. 20 years ago, the Chinese economy was a fraction of the size of ours today, but now their economy rivals ours and they're using their newfound power to repress minorities, control their people, and commit human atrocities. In the book, the Chinese define cultural warfare as influencing the cultural biases of a targeted country by imposing your own cultural viewpoints. It's not just Hollywood. China has also established Confucius Institutes in American colleges and Confucius classrooms in high schools. At one point, there were as many as 100 college campuses and 500 high schools involved. What is so insidious about this is that whoever establishes an institute must sign an agreement they will never disparage China. Under the guise of cultural exchange, students are hit with a propaganda machine. Then there's the matter of TikTok and other technology plays to further Chinese interests. Cultural warfare is just one more area of unrestricted warfare. You have to stand up now or be taken down by the Chinese Communist Party. It's not too late if we recognize the threat. You can learn more at economicwarroom.com. This is Kevin Freeman with your two-minute warning from the Economic War Room.